Okay guys, I uh, want to show you how fast you could start making money in Bitcoins, specifically Bitcoin, not any other uh, coins out there. So where do you start? You're gonna drop about four grand on this S19 Pro. Okay, that's $4,000. Let's just, boom, $4,000. Problem is it's not shipped until August. So between now and August, anything can happen. Uh, history would tell us there would be a dip in the market between now and then. Uh, who knows? It could keep going. It could stay about the same. So $4,000 and you got to wait eight months. Uh, so how profitable is this $4,000 investment? Well, if we go over here, we can calculate that it's going to make about 22 bucks a day. Uh, that equals to $722 a month. But that's not factoring in electricity. So I believe this monster runs at about... 3,000 watts. So that being said, let's see if it shows us here. It doesn't say exactly what, yeah, 3,250. So that's more than three microwaves running at the same time all the time. So the power demand is insane. So let's do that. Let's say we're in San Jose and we're running this, okay? That's gonna give us a profit of all the way down to $2 a day uh, with a monthly profit of $93. So you can see why it is not profitable to mine in the state of California. Santa Clara is an exception. If you are an industrial site, a small industrial, it's about 13 to 16 kilowatts per hour in cost. So we'll update it with that. And now it has gone up to about less than $10 a day or $335 per month. So how do we overcome the biggest cost here? The first solution is to go to a place that has cheap electric. For example, this is a hosting facility where you can pay uh, a very small fraction, so five and a half cents per kilowatt hour. So if we factor that into here, and let's review the numbers. So now it's gone up to about almost $18 a day or $590 per month in profit. Um, on top of that, though, there is a rental fee uh, of 140 bucks. So you subtract that from the 584 figure. You have your pure profit. So let's do some math real quick. 584 minus what was it? 140 equals 444 dollars per month. So if we were to take that original cost of the unit, about 4,000 dollars. Divide that by $444. This thing would pay for itself in nine months, and then you're just printing money at that point. Uh, obviously, the market can be volatile. History tells us it is probably peaked and will go back down. Uh, but long term, this will more than pay for itself. Uh, in nine months, it will be nothing but pure profit in the sense of, you know, 500 bucks a month.